Please, come in, sit down. You know where $2 million is? $2 million? Yeah. It's with uh, Victor Telegio and Alphonse Simon. No, actually, it's not with Victor Telegio or Alphonse Simon. He fucking knows about it. It's gone missing. Did you know that? No, I know nothing about oh. that. Where's it going? Well, that's interesting that you said that, because while you were on your way over here, we got an uh, anonymous phone call from someone who said that in exchange for immunity for the two of you and a reduced sentence for Carmine Polito, we got our $2 million back. That's interesting. That's very interesting. I have no idea. No idea? No, no idea, idea what you're talking about. I get it. I understand how these deals are made, right? See, someone has leverage. Anthony, fuck them. Fuck them. It's over. We I got them for so. wire fraud. It's over. You're done. I, you're both done. I, I, you're done. I don't think so. I don't think so. Oh, you don't think so? Richard, you requested the two million, and you gave Brenda the account number. No, no. We didn't we didn't do any of that. None of them. How do we know that you don't have the money? Am I living in a fucking nightmare right now? I find this a little offensive. I really, I find this a little offensive, and, and, and I don't see that you got don't any sort of cock solid listen case to me. Listen to me. at all. Listen to me. We're dealing right. with a very clever individual. Richard, don't let him. Richard, think about it, all right? You got some big arrests. You got U.S. congressmen. You look good. You're going to be all over the news. You know what doesn't look good? Story about gross incompetence. I have a warrant for. I'm sorry, do I have the wrong office? Is this 701? Alphonse Simon? This is 701. My name is Roger Thigpen. I've had this office for 25 years. I'm a divorce attorney. You lost $2 million of taxpayer money because you were confused about the location and the identity of Victor Telagio's attorney? The role of Telegio's attorney, Alphonse Simone, was played by our friend Ed Malone, the cold cut king of Long Island, whose party we were at when Sydney and I first met. Alphonse Simone. People believe what they want to believe, Richie. No, because you conned me. That's why. Because you both fucking conned me. You got under me. You did. You know, that, 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 uh, that doesn't sound so good either, right there. You know what I mean? And I don't know what you're talking about, but let's just assume you want to go with that story. Really? That's the story you want to go with, all right? That's what you want the New York Times to hear. That you got conned by the very con men who you forced to entrap the members of Congress in the first place. That's what you want to go with? That doesn't sound so good for your whole thing, does it? And how ironic that the ones who are working hardest to get the economy of New Jersey going. Those are the ones that you round up. And why? Why? Because what? They're the easiest to go after? And what about the real bullshit artists? You didn't even come close to the big leagues. Those big guys, the money men. That's what I was trying to go after. I'm sorry to tell you, you got none of them. You know, Richard, I think uh, we may call you as a witness, but otherwise you're done. I, I think you better go home. Stop. Go on home, Richard. 